accelerating. And we're racing towards this technological singularity. And what are some of the crazy implications of what this means? So I'll share with you a few. Uh, first of all, I think we're heading towards what Ray and Aubrey de Grey, not far from here, are called longevity skate velocity, in which there's a moment in time that for every year that you're alive, science and technology is extending your life for more than a year. Right? Uh, there's an argument of is it 12 years from now, which Ray will say, or 20 years from now, which Aubrey will say, or is it 30 years from now? It's potentially within a lot of your lifetimes. Let's begin with that. Number two, uh, we're heading towards a post-capitalist society. What does that mean? There's a moment in time where nanotechnology, AI, robotics, all of these technologies have accelerated to a point where um, the incremental cost of creating something is effectively zero. If I have a nanobot in my hand over here, and I say, okay, listen, borrow some atoms from my skin and make me you know, 85 copies of my nanobot, and then I reach out and toss them to you, and each of you have a nanobot now, and you throw it in the soil and you say, hey, would you please make me an electric Lamborghini? And it organizes the soil and it, and it says to you, listen, I need some more lithium or some more titanium, and you toss some in. It uses an open data set. The, the cost of that electric Lamborghini is the cost of the raw materials and the energy, right? And if we're in a world of energy abundance, we have 8,000 times more energy from the sun